guys, welcome to my channel and welcome back to the Hamilton Cats and Dogs specials where I'm giving my Hamilton Sims some pets and today we are giving some pets to George Washington. And if you missed the last episode, I will link it in the eye in the corner. I gave some pets to Lawrence and Hamilton. But in the last Let's Play episode, I asked you guys to give me some suggestions for what kind of animals I should give to my Hamilton Sims. And the number one request for George Washington was to give him a cat named Hamilton or named after Hamilton because in the musical you have this line that goes Martha Washington named a feral, feral tomcat after him him being Hamilton Alexander Hamilton um, obviously we do not have Martha Washington yet in this let's play she's gonna join at some point but I'm kind of focusing on these characters for now before I'm gonna add more characters but she is gonna join but because she isn't in the let's play yet I guess you guys wanted me to give a cat named Hamilton anyway but in this version to George Washington and not Martha Washington uh, and I thought that was a really cute idea and also I think it's kind of fitting because in my let's play George is kind of a little bit of an outsider like he lives somewhere else he isn't always invited to stuff he's kind of seen as like the dad of the group but dads don't always get invited to social gatherings and he wants he wants to be friends with these people so i feel like he's kind of lonely so he shows up all of the time you know like the stalker washington that we we kept seeing um so yeah it makes sense that he would get cats plural I'll tell you more about that and name it after his friends. So you can see here that I gave uh, <laughs> the Hamilton cat a little star on his back. I thought that was kind of cute and fitting because, you know, it's it's the musical and like the logo has a star in it and it's like about America and, you know, it's Alexander Hamilton. It just seemed right to give this cat a little star on his back and it's also just a cute little detail. So I also gave him some traits that I felt like fitted Hamilton as a character. Um, I'm not sure which ones, clever, playful and mischievous. Yeah, I thought that would be kind of nice because Hamilton doesn't always play by the rules. He's really clever uh, and he's also kind of like playful and just, I don't know, it just, it seemed like a, a Hamilton if Hamilton was a cat, that would be like the closest traits. But as you can see, I am not quitting here. We're gonna try some different cats. And the reason I'm doing that, first of all, I was kind of thinking he lives at Mount Vernon. Uh, that's a really, really big place. So he has lots, lots and lots of rooms for cats. So I created him three more cats. And then I thought, wouldn't it be really funny if he named one of them Alexander Hamilton, <laughs> one of them John Lawrence, one of them, Marquis de Lafayette, <laughs> and one of them, Hercules Mulligan. <laughs> so I did that. I'm, I'm kind of sorry. I'm also kind of not sorry because <laughs> I think it's really funny. So the cat we're creating right now is Hercules Mulligan. I made him like a little more fluffy and bigger. I don't know. I just thought that was kind of cute. Sort of like if a cat would be really muscular, that would be this cat. I don't know if that makes sense. He just looks tough to me this cat but also like soft and tough at the same time and that's mulligan to me it's like he is you know what i mean he's kind of like he has this really soft side that wants to take care of people and kind of be a dad to people and and cook and do all that sort of stuff but he also has this really tough side where he's a spy and like he's he has this like two sides of him and that cat feels like a really tough cat but also a really fluffy cat and then the last cat we're creating is Marquis de Lafayette obviously uh, and we also created John Lawrence but that was so quickly that I couldn't but that cat seems like really I don't know like delicate and pretty and that's Lawrence to me and then Lafayette I made that this cat look a little more playful and fun and like wants to mess around a little bit I think I made him talkative friendly kind of like the social media site that he's doing in this particular version of Hamilton like my alternate universe let's play that I'm doing and I'm not sure what the last one is and I think I gave Lawrence affectionate friendly and curious that seemed like fun things to do but we're now gonna jump into some gameplay where I show you Washington interacting with his cats. 